Welcome back, eh? This is the Canadian Silver Seeker, and I hope you guys are having another great day like I am. Just got this package in the mail, and this is a special one. I am excited about it, so let's take a look together. Cut the end of the end of it here, because I do not want to cut this package. From what I understand, it is sealed, and I am going to keep it that way. Let's slide that out of there. Oh, beautiful. This is the 2008 Baby Lullaby Sterling Silver Dollar Set. In 2008, they came out with a Sterling Silver Dollar Set for the Baby Lullaby, for the Baby Tin Keepsakes, and for the Wedding Anniversary Set. They all have a... Uh, Sterling Silver Looney, they all are the same design, just a loon, just like that one. And as you can see, this one is still fully sealed. I am not going to take this out of the packaging. Um, this one is a special one. And if I ever want to make my money back on this one, I'm going to have to keep it in this original packaging. I did actually get a really good deal. I saved almost $100 on this particular coin. I ended up buying this one on Kijiji. Um, these sets do not come around very often. And by that, I mean really do not come around very often. I've been searching for very for months now. Um, I have never seen the 2008 Baby Tin, um, and I've never seen the 2008 Wedding. I've also never seen the 2007 Wedding set. I do not, not know the uh, mintages on these, um, but you can rest assured they are very, very low. I know the 2007 ones um, for the... Baby Lullaby is about 3200 for the Baby Tin set. Also, actually, surprisingly, 3200 And actually, a couple more, despite the fact that the Baby Lullaby goes for about 200 to $250 Canadian. And the Tin set, despite there being a few more mintage of that, it's like, it's like 10 or 15 more, it actually goes for between six and $800 typically. Um, doesn't make a lot of sense to me. People are literally paying more premium for, I guess, the case and the tin set than, than the CD set. Because, like I say, the CD set is actually rarer than the tin set in 2007. As far as 2008 numbers, I don't have any. The 2007, um, wedding anniversary, there's less than a, less than a thousand. I believe there's about 800 of those. And so that one is very rare, very expensive, usually over a thousand dollars. I don't think I've actually even seen one on sale yet in the last few months that I've been looking. So whether I acquire those, I do not know. I got this one because like I said, I got a super good deal on this. Um, when I was talking about making my money back, I could probably take it to my LCS today and get paid what I paid for this coin. So very happy with this purchase. And just a little bit more about this coin. So this coin in 2008, before 2007, um, all the loony silver dollars were made of sterling silver. They are about seven grams. At 2012, they upped their their silver loonies, which are 495 at 2012, they upped their weight to 7.89 grams, makes it a little easier for you to distinguish um, a silver loony as opposed to a non silver loony um, because they are gold plated and they all look basically the same with the same diameter. Um, but yeah, this particular one, actual silver weight is about 0.2 of an ounce of actual silver. Hope you guys like. Thanks for sticking around listening to me ramble. Remember, it doesn't cost you a single piece of silver or gold to like and subscribe. You guys mean the world to me. Happy stacking, eh?